What is one thing that software engineers often get wrong about open source? Like you've been in the open source ecosystem, even before Facebook at Sancha, developer advocate, you led the team there. Now you're doing your own open source project. What do you think is something that people frequently uh, get wrong or they have a misconception about contributing that you would like to dispel? I would say uh, it's very hard to generalize because obviously people come from lots of different backgrounds and uh, may have lots of preconceived ideas. But I would say the one thing to make sure is don't treat this transactionally. Don't think that, you know, I make a pull request, I get a job. Or, you know, I work on this project, I become a maintainer. Because open source is, well, maybe this, this, is, this is the bigger picture. You know, open source is only partially about the actual software, right? And hmm. a much less understood and more kind of fuzzy factor is the community and the other humans that you're getting to work with on this project. So you might be a killer engineer in terms of being able to crank a bunch of code into this project, but if you're a jerk when you try to land that pull request, or you're rude or insensitive, or you can't explain what you've done with the other people that are involved, um, and you just see it as this transaction, it's, it's not going to work, right? So I think you have to spend a lot of time thinking about how the other members of the community are going to react to you. You need to be very empathetic to what's happening already. You can't just come in and say, boom, here's a massive code mod. I've decided to change all your tabs to spaces. Like, uh, no, yeah. <laughs> you're not going to succeed there. Um, and so I would say, yeah, the, 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 the one thing perhaps less, inex uh, less experienced uh, engineers will, will, will face is um, the the... You know, it's it's all about the code, but no, it needs to be about the the people. And so that takes a journey, right? Uh, and again, the same will happen when you join a company. You really will only be successful if you figured out how to work with the team around you. You figured out how to work with other teams. You figured out how to build those relationships. You figured out how to make trade-offs, compromise when you, you know, you, you can't make a compelling argument and someone else's uh, ideas prevail. Like those are all skills that you're going to need in a professional environment. And those are going to happen in the open source world too. So yeah, don't be transactional. Think about the other people. Be nice, courteous, graceful, right. <laughs> grateful, all those other nice positive uh, adjectives because those are going to be the things that really help you stand out. Um, and they, those have to complement your agile engineering skills, which you know uh, have to be there as well, of course. Yeah, that is well said. I think being able to code and write high-quality code is the admission ticket to this event, to this dance, but you still have to yep. show up to the dance and actually be nice and ask people to dance with you that's how you succeed but it's not just enough to get the ticket